working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my time. Hey guys, happy Monday. It's Monday, April 1st. 12.45. Um, I just walked in the door. I don't have any April Fool's jokes for you today. Life is a joke, literally. Like, <laughs> um, I am about to season up some chicken because I'm getting an air fryer from TikTok shop. <laughs> And it should be here in the next couple of hours. So I'm gonna put this chicken in to like marinate and then cook it in the air fryer, which I'm so excited about because I've always wanted one and I finally got one. So I'm very excited. So I'm gonna make about, let's see, one, two, Today was interesting. It's been so fucking... Like, we're just... Our staffing is so bad right now, and like... Like, they honestly need to immediately because we have nobody. Like, we have nobody that can open or close the store. There's one, well, there's two shift supervisors left. Like, everybody is gone, and I don't know. I can't really, like... You know, I'm not really in a position to talk shit, like, but I really, I, I will not be happy if they don't promote me and they, and they hire someone else. Like, I would love to say that I would quit because like, that would be like the third time that, cause like at some point I have to like stand up for myself, you know? Like, I can't keep allowing them to think that 
that that's okay. You know, it's not. So I'm going to season this chicken up and then once that's done, I'm going to put it in the fridge to marinate and then I'm going to try to take a nap. I have therapy at three o'clock, so I'm going to try to nap until then and then get up, do my session. Hopefully the air fryer will be here by then and then I will cook. I need to clean up this kitchen, but I'm going to do that when I get up because I feel like I'm constantly washing dishes. Like even I, I, I cook, I wash dishes and then there's more like it's just. I wish I had a dishwasher, <laughs> like, but I'll be back. Hi guys, so it is later on in the day, it's 5.30. I'm about to film this TikTok simultaneously as I make my chicken wings because I have to film the, um, the, um, air fryer. So I was like, I might as well do it all together so yeah that's what i'm about to do i just cleaned up in here so it's aesthetically pleasing really crazy what the iphone camera will pick up on like trying to get the angles right around here all right to it So we're here in my regular ass kitchen. No stainless steel appliances, white fridge, black microwave vibes, because I have to show you something. Finally got my hands on an air fryer. I have been wanting one for so long. I don't know why I'm just now getting onto the wave. I know, I'm late, but let's unbox. I already have some chicken wings marinating in the fridge. To make in this bad boy because I found some recipes and I heard that chicken wings go hard in the air fryer so this is her she is available on my TikTok shop if you are interested go get you one cute recipe book which I freaking love I will absolutely be utilizing this and probably making as much as I can <gasps> are you kidding? oh it's up and it's stuck I love not having to like use my stove and my oven yeah spicy drumsticks yes so I'm just taking out things I don't have a ton of counter space because like I said regular ass kitchen I don't have an island so this is probably gonna be stored underneath until I'm using it and you know you know this bronzy detailing that it has that is bomb so I have an outlet right there
I'm just gonna quickly glance through the instruction manual so I can see what is what. That skimmit is in here. Oh, yay! And then this. Oh, this probably goes in there. So it, like, you put your food on that, right? Right. I'm new to this. Okay. Help me. Clean the catch oil plate with hot water with some washing liquid and a non-abrasive sponge. Okay, so it says to clean this, I'm gonna do that. off I just used some dish soap Dawn dish soap that's all I had So it's going to take about 15 minutes for it to preheat, so I'll be back to put the chicken in there. Okay, so as you can see, air fryer, love her. I'm actually going to, while I wait for that to preheat, let me save this in my draft. Awesome. I need to order... It's hot. This little kitchen is getting hot, bro. Like, I need to order some stuff from DoorDash real quick. I'm gonna be real. That. I cut myself. I'm not giving you the finger. I don't know what is going on with me, like, I just always stay hurting myself in some way. Get some paper towels. That's it, because I'm not trying to spend too much. So I didn't take a nap. I mean, I tried, but my neighbors are being fucking loud, arguing again. So I send an email to the leasing office. This was like the fourth time that I've complained about these people. And nothing gets done. Like, they are so fucking disruptive. It don't make no sense. All right. Put that in there. Did I do this right? Let me make sure I did this right. Because I didn't start counting down the time. Oh. <laughs> 
so I didn't know you had to hit the button. It's preheating now. You hear it? Yeah. Cause I was like, it's not counting down. It said 15 minutes, five minutes now, not five minutes, but you know, it's 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 preheating now. So now I'll be back. <laughs> All right, cute. Can I put the foil on that? Cause I don't like, should I just put it in there like that? I guess so, that's the video that I watched. The lady put her food right in it, so. The wings are in. I have the timer set for 25 minutes. I'm gonna put actually, let me save this. So we're in. I'm gonna put a timer on my phone to come back in 15 minutes and flip them. So I'm hungry too. And then probably at the 15 minute mark, I'm gonna make my salad. Cause I have Caesar salad that I'm making. When I tell you it smells so good in here. Let's make this Caesar salad with bacon. So I have a goal this week, probably, I'll probably start it Wednesday night. Cause I'm off Thursday and Friday this week. Maybe Friday I might work, I don't know. I don't know, like I be needing the money, but like I also like, I'm trying to like, you know, not let them play in my face. Like, like I'm a good fucking employee, and the fact that they haven't promoted me yet, like I'm trying to like not do too much. It's like not too much on me helping y'all, and y'all ain't help you. Y'all don't help me, type shit. You know. Um, I'm gonna organize my kitchen because I'm pretty much sure I'm gonna stay here for another year, unless I was to randomly come into like 10k this week, and I can afford you know, this month's rent and a fucking deposit for a new apartment and the first month, like, I don't, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't like being an adult, I don't. I don't like making decisions. I want to be taken care of. I was crying to my therapist about that shit today. Like, I'm tired of just, like, thugging it out on my own all the fucking time, like, I just want to be able to count on somebody to like, you know what I mean? Like be there for me and just lighten my load a little bit. Like, no, I don't want to not work and be self-sufficient. Obviously, yes, I want those things. But like, damn. It would be like, it's nice to have somebody be like, yo, at least I got you. Like, I got you. And I'm not talking about in like a romantic, like, I mean, yeah, that too. Like, I would love to have, you know, a husband. Hey. There's not the lid for that.
do another 10 minutes. 10 more minutes. Okay. I'm about to cheat and look at it before I record it for TikTok and then do it again. <laughs> it looks so good. I'm so excited, y'all. Another 10 minutes. <gasps> Yo, are you? Baby. Yes. Go get you one of these. Y'all probably already got one. I know I'm late. These wings are so good. I cannot wait to make more stuff in this. Oh my god. Best purchase ever. This is so good. Look at that. It's giving, like, rotisserie. Mmm. Salad. I'm so excited to make other things. Like I'm gonna make every recipe in that recipe book. This is the best thing I've ever ever discovered. I'm so happy. And look, no cleanup, no grease. No pots and pans everywhere. This is the best invention ever. It's in my TikTok shop. Go get you one. Bye. Y'all, let me show you. so good it's perfect they came out perfect i'm about to go grub i'm gonna go grub finish watching this podcast i might be back later i can't guarantee it but we'll see bye <laughs> hi friends happy tuesday Tuesday 
April 2nd. I'm taking you guys with me because we are going in my bedroom. I just walked in the door, took off all my clothes, <laughs> put my pajamas on. It is pouring down rain outside. It has been raining all fucking day. I hate the rain. If you know me, you know I'm not a rain girl at all. So, I'm really excited to say these next few words. I don't have anything to do. <laughs> like, I am getting, it's it's 12.50. I got off at 12.30. I stopped at, it was free because girly came into Starbucks today and I, I, I let her use my, my number so her drink was free. But they hook us up anyway. I've talked about this before, but I go in with the intent that I'm going to pay. And if they, you know, if they hook me up, blessings. But I don't assume that they're going to because, you know, I was just having like, I don't really know what it's called. Well, I kind of, it's like, um, now of course I can't think of the term. Where it's like you just you're you're bothered by everything that's like on you. Like you have to take your jewelry off. You have to take, like if your hair is in a ponytail, you need to take it out. What is that called? Ugh. I can't think of it. But I think it's because I'm so tired. I was the last two nights I haven't been. I didn't go to bed at a reasonable hour at all. Like last both two last two nights I went to sleep at like midnight. And if you gotta get up at 4 a.m., that is just not a smart move. But the night before last, I just couldn't relax because I was off before that. And when it's my day off and then I have to go back to work, for some reason I can never sleep. And then last night I was on the phone, boo loving. <laughs> um, I was like, I gotta go to bed. Like, but it's like that thing where it's like you don't wanna stop talking to them. And it's like, damn, like. I gotta go. <laughs> so, and I wasn't like expecting him to call me. Well, we were like FaceTiming at first and then he had to make a phone call and then he called me back. And like, we just, it's just, it's very much like we can just be on the phone or on FaceTime and not necessarily have to have every, you know, space filled with conversation. Like we can just, be on the phone you know which I kind of love that like it's nice because it's like you don't there's no pressure to like talk about a certain topic or like you know you're just like whatever and then like <laughs> talk about things as they come up like we just be laughing and just cracking jokes and like you know it's cute it's giving cute who I'm hungry I'm a little nauseous I don't know if that's from the car ride ginger ale will do it i still can't think of what that's called that's gonna bother me oh my god i really need to stop eating in bed but like i still have some chicken that from yesterday that i made in the air fryer so i'll probably have that later for dinner if i don't I mean, I'm not going to eat all of this, so I have some food. You guys know how I feel about leftovers. <laughs> so I just got a bowl, as always. But I got chicken this time. I usually get the, the pork carnitas, but I didn't want that today. I was like, let me try this chicken. El Pastor. Um... It was a chill day at work. Like I said, it's pouring down rain. So like, I don't know. I don't understand how people come out in the rain to sit in a fucking Starbucks cafe. Like stay home, stay the fuck home. They did it when it snowed too. Like that should be illegal. Like unless you're going to work, you should have to stay off the fucking roads, especially if it's snowing. Like, Mm. It's good. 
So I've had that um, collagen powder that I got from TikTok shop two days now. I've been I've made it with my coffee and I haven't tasted it at all, which is good because that means I'm gonna really use it. So hopefully, I see a difference. You know, just in like overall health, as you know, it has hyaluronic acid, it has other like peptides and stuff in it. All stuff that I should be, you know, nurturing my body with, but I'm not. So I'm going to eat and then I'm probably going to lay down. For real. And that's it. I don't have anything planned. I don't I'm not doing nothing. I damn sure ain't leaving this house. So <laughs> I'll be back. Hi guys, happy Wednesday. Wednesday, April 3rd. It's 4 06 p.m. I am about to color my bundles. Um my hair appointment is tomorrow at two. So I have to color my bundles and then color my hair. I got all this stuff. Well, I mean, I didn't need anything. I just need box dye and a bucket because I'm doing like the watercolor method or whatever. So the uh, maintenance people are outside. I forgot they're doing this like emergency maintenance thing. So they're probably going to interrupt my vibe in any minute now. Like, So I just need to like have a video that I'm watching. I mean, it's really self-explanatory how she does it. And shake them up and then I point. So I got a bucket. There's my bucket. I'll be back in a second. I gotta use the bathroom. I need more water. That's not enough. So I'm gonna boil some more. Um, I feel like I should probably put this dye on my hair a while while I wait for that water to boil. So let's go do that. Alright, we're gonna end the bathroom. Doing 
one for my head because it's not going to take. My hair is pretty silky right now, so one should be enough, I hope. kitchen get these bundles done nothing on my feet I've done that before you freaking have dye on your foot you track it through the damn house oops oh happy Thursday I just came from getting my hair done your girl is back she's back I got these bundles from TikTok shop I showed you guys and I just got them sewn in, traditional sewing. I just need you to know this, this is all me. <laughs> My friend was like, your leave out is crazy. I said, I know, or, I know. But yeah, I literally just walked in the door and made myself a tuna fish sandwich because I didn't eat today. eat this I might eat another one to be honest well I had like a half a chicken sandwich that I made earlier while I was running out the door to my appointment then I stopped at Starbucks I had a coffee and like a fourth of the sandwich that I bought well I really didn't want it I use Starbucks every fucking day I didn't want that sandwich but it was the only thing that was it wasn't the one that I work at, it was a different one. And it was like the only like quick thing in the plaza that I could go to. So I was like, damn it, I don't want this shit, but whatever. Um, I'm about to relax for a little bit. I'm going to have a drink later. Because obviously I have to be seen. Hello. I have to be seen tonight. Yeah. Yeah. So my um, one of my customers that comes in the Starbies is a bartender at this spot that I've gone to a couple of times. She's going to be there tonight. It's ladies night. So free entry for ladies until 11 and also first drink on them on the bar. So I'm in there all by myself. Yeah. Um, I'm back. <laughs> I will be back though. Happy Friday. It's right here. Perfect. It's Friday, April 5th. It is currently just about 4 p.m. I am wand curling this hair um, because I plan to make some content um, Brooke is on well she will be on her way here soon so I'm gonna do her makeup 
I think she's going to a concert or something, she said. So we're going to have a little makeup and hookah session real quick. And then when she leaves, I'm going to do some makeup on myself and do a little content moment. Um, I have a lot that I need to film, but I'm not obviously gonna do it all today. Um, I thought I was going to work today because <laughs> my boss, he's a mess. He freaking texted me yesterday, right? And he's like, hey, can you help out tomorrow from four to seven? And I'm like, that's only three hours. I guess I could do that, right? And then he's like, okay, I'm still trying to find a shift to close the store. I'll let you know. And I'm like, okay. So today, around like 1130, I text him and I was like, hey, you know, what's tea <laughs> with, you know, you finding a shift? And he's like, oh, I'm waiting to hear back. They haven't responded to me yet, whatever, whatever. And I'm like, okay, well, you know, please keep me updated because, you know, luckily I didn't have anything planned, but at the same time, I kind of like didn't do anything all day because I thought I was gonna go to work, you know? And I'm like, I'm not gonna get myself into anything crazy if I have to like end up going to work, right? So, yeah, it's like 2.30 and I would have to be there at four and he hasn't said anything to me. So I'm like, hey, <laughs> what's tea, girl, you know? So he's like, still haven't heard anything. And then maybe like three minutes later, he texts me back and he's like, okay, uh, so-and-so confirmed for the shift um see you sunday thank you and i'm like sunday the fuck are you talking about this man meant to ask me to work sunday night no <laughs> no i'm the opener i'm the only person that goes in there at five o'clock in the morning to open that fucking store i am not i'm not doing a clopen okay which is a close and then an open absolutely not i was like if it's four to seven i can do it you know, I can get off at seven and come home and have plenty of time to get in bed, you know, get ready for bed and, you know, try to get me some sleep. But like, we normally close at 8.30, which means you're not out of there till at least 9.30. And that depends on who's closing, how fast they are, you know, because the closing shift has to count the safe and do all these things that take time. And like, they try to get things done you know throughout the shift that support the closing duties but you know customers <clears throat> you know people are they're assholes they're gonna come in right before you close and you know it's annoying like so you can't get everything done so I'm like no thanks like sorry like I was fully ready to go help today but no I'm not going in on a Sunday night I'm not so <laughs> back to plan a which is doing content so that's what I'm doing. I'm getting ready to do that now. She gets off at four. That's that's her end time, but she's a server. So, you know, that could probably be a little bit after that. She said that her last table just got their food. But it's like a sports bar. So it's like wings and sandwiches and stuff. So she's not like they're having, you know, it's not like fine dining or some shit. So yeah, um, last night I went out and had a drink. Well, I had two drinks all by my lonesome. It was cute. Um, the place where I went, it was ladies night and the first drink, well, it was like free entry for ladies until 11 and then first drink on them. And I know the bartender because she comes in Starbucks all the time. I don't know if I said this already, but um, so I had two lemon drop martinis, and then I had a I ate because I was so hungry. I like didn't eat anything yesterday. I had a bowl like a salmon and rice bowl. It was all right. It was a little too seasoned, like too much. 
and then um, yeah, I um, spent the night with my uh, my little boot thing or whatever he is. <laughs> I went to his house because he didn't feel like coming out because he had been drinking at home. I guess he had like... Fucking maintenance. Like, this place is a mess. I'm like, well, did you put in a request for your refrigerator? No, I didn't. No, I fucking didn't. Like, they were here yesterday doing their routine maintenance or whatever the fuck. And I'm like, y'all are annoying. Like, stop coming here. Threw me all the way off. <laughs> Brooke is on her way. It's good timing. So I'm on the last section here. Anyway, I don't even know what I was saying. <laughs> what the fuck was I talking about? Oh well. Well, yeah, I think I was saying how he didn't want to come out because he was already drinking. So I just went to his house instead, which was different because, like, that used to be. <laughs> so back when we used to talk last year and I wasn't living in this apartment, I was living with Lauren. And, yeah, I used to just go to his house because I didn't want to bring him to her house like she has kids and like it just was not there was wasn't privacy you know what I mean like so we would go to his house and even though you know he lives with his family like it was still way more private than bringing him to her house but we've pretty much only been here you know at my place obviously so it was like the first time I went over there was not last night, but the night before. And it was just like, it was so different. Like, I'm like, whoa, I haven't been here in a long time. Literally nothing has changed. He got a new bed. That's it. <laughs> but it was just like, wow. This brought up a lot of memories of when I used to be over there literally every single night of my life. And we would wake up and he would take me home and go to work and like it was just if you know you know if y'all were around for that portion of my life <laughs> it was a time to be alive that's for sure I mean it's still good right now I would say but you know I don't 
I'm not feeling too confident about the future, if that makes sense. Like, that's a little frustrating because it's like, how, how am I supposed to, you know, plan for my future and like manifest the things that I really truly want if I'm allowing space for less than what I'm looking for, even though in so many ways it's more than what I've ever had and more than what I thought I would have, if that makes sense. Like, you know, there's a lot of boxes that are checked that I've never been able to check before, you know what I mean? But at the same time, that's just, I'm learning a lot about myself, about what I really want, what I will tolerate and what I won't, you know, and for the most part, like, it's good and it's better than what I've ever experienced and it's better than it was the first time around. So, you know, I'm going to give credit to growth and I'll give, you know, give that person grace because a lot of us don't know what the fuck we're doing out here and I recognize that I really don't know what I'm doing but I know what I want you know so that's that <laughs> but I really enjoy their company and I know that they enjoy mine because you know it's it's shown through words and actions it's not just saying things and not backing it up you know like I don't have to I do because I have an anxious attachment style <laughs> so I do you know sometimes take it where it doesn't need to be taken because I'm internalizing behaviors instead of recognizing that you know there isn't anything for me to be worried about like and if you know if what I think is happening is happening then that's confirmation Lisa like that's showing you that this person isn't about what they say they are and let that be your answer right but I have a tendency to you know kind of press the issue and make it about me instead of verbalizing and, and acting on what it is that I know that I deserve. And if you can't meet that, then you don't get to be in my life, you know? So, like I said, I'm learning a lot. At the same time, it's like, I kinda, I know what I'm doing. I feel like I know what I'm doing. And, you know, we'll see. For where I am, like location-wise, like actually physically, I'm doing all right, <laughs> if that makes sense. Like the pickings are slim as it is. So I'm doing pretty good for what's provided to me, if that makes sense. So the hair is done. I need hairspray because I literally don't have anything. And these are definitely my hair. Maybe not the, the weave, but my hair will absolutely fall out of this soon, but whatever. Okay, let me turn this off. She says she's going to be here soon. Let me go look out the window. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to bring my speaker out here so we can jam. Hopefully she is going to set up the hookah because I'm still not that confident on my hookah skills. <laughs> but I'm going to put this camera back on the charger really quick until she gets here so that it doesn't play or hit on me while she's here so I can record. So I will be RB.
I am back. It is 6.30. I don't know why I'd be quote. 6.30. It's 6.30. Um, I am currently cooking. So the last clip that you saw was I did Brooke's makeup. It came out so good. She has perfect skin. So like... I said that I was going to do content. I'm not. I don't feel like it. <laughs> so yeah, I decided I'm just gonna do it tomorrow. I also have Sunday off, so I have time. I just, I don't know. After curling my hair and like doing her makeup, I'm like, hmm. Maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, so I'm making some chicken in my air fryer and some rice, rice and beans, and I'll probably make some broccoli. And this should last me at least today and tomorrow because I'll eat this again tomorrow because I have a lot of chicken. From the first time that I made it, I bought a big ass pack and I only made half of it. So I'm making the other half plus some other like drumsticks that I had in there. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. Not really planning on doing anything for the rest of the night. I have work, so you know that 4 a.m. comes fairly quickly my hair is dropping already per usual my hair never holds a curl but tonight um banking on that i'm not gonna have company <laughs> i'm gonna do the heatless curl thing that i have because i think the headband one that i have will work good now that i have these bundles because it's long enough to like wrap it all around so we'll see how that turns out Oh, and I got a, um, a mini fridge. Brand sent me a mini fridge. So I set that up on my vanity because I have all my skincare in it. I'm so excited about that. Something about cold skincare. Like, it just makes you feel like you're at the spa. Like, your, your skincare is, like, really doing what it needs to do, you know? So. Yeah, I'm watching full coverage while I cook. Um, I just made a hookah, so I'm taking some hits of that just chilling relaxing enjoying my my alone time and um yeah that's all i'm doing right now guys i am probably gonna after i eat i'll probably hop in the shower um I've been really wanting to self tan. I probably should, but maybe I should do it tonight so that way when I do my content tomorrow, I'm tan. That's if I feel like that. Yeah, it takes so much to do. I don't have money here to do my back. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to get back to cooking and watching my podcast. I will check in. I'll try to check in before I go to bed. If I don't, I will see you tomorrow. Hi guys, happy Saturday. Saturday, April 6th. It's probably like two something, I don't know. I just got home. I am beat. Like, warming up the chicken that I made last night for some reason I was really craving some mac and cheese so I got some shells and I'm gonna make some corn to go with it with my chicken I'm gonna eat and I'm gonna lay down <laughs> because I'm it was so busy today like 
Nobody should have to work like that. Like, oh, look what I got. I'll do this for the thumbnail. <laughs> So, you know, Starbucks has these deals or whatever with Stanley. So I wasn't able, I mean, I never really like, I, I'm not a, a Stanley fanatic. Like I, they've come out, we've had what, two of them already, like Christmas and now, excuse me, there was a Christmas one. That was red and then like a spring, or maybe it was Barbie, I'm not sure, but it was pink. Oh yeah, it was Barbie or Valentine's Day. And then this one is the spring one, the blue. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get me one because I do need to step it up in the water department and I do like my water cold. So I got me one. because I didn't, didn't get sleep last night, not enough. Um, I had a little sleepover. <laughs> and it was very last minute. But I got over there late, so it was like already past my bedtime when I even went. Yeah, so I'm feeling it now. Luckily, I'm off tomorrow, which means I can lay around for the rest of the day. Tomorrow is going to be my content day. Unless by some chance I end up going out tonight, I doubt it. But if I do, and I end up putting makeup on, then I will use that opportunity to get cute and you know I'll make a couple videos or whatever but yeah the scalp starting to itch the sewing is already starting to itch <laughs> it don't take long the hair is holding up beautifully though I one curled it yesterday and the curls are looking good oh I did do the um the headband, the heatless curl thing, and <laughs> I took it out because I was leaving, right? I'm like, I'm not going to show up over there with this thing on my head like this. The curls look so good. I'm like, if I would have left it on overnight, like, this would have not dropped. Like, I mean, it's still kind of in there, but like, they looked, oh my god, they looked so good when I took them out. I'm like, damn it, why you gotta hit me up and I have no willpower? <laughs> I'm like, of course I'm coming over. Are you kidding? What the hell? So, you know how these things go. <laughs> it's exciting and, you know, it's just like, I don't mind it, but, yeah, I'm about to finish making this food and lay my ass down for a little bit and then I will check in later. I need to start editing the vlog tonight. So I'm not rushing to do it tomorrow morning. 
I'm so tired. That's why I'm it scratching. I get itchy when I'm sleepy. <laughs> All right, I will be back later. Hey guys, it is later on in the evening. I am freshly showered. I did a mask. Now I have these that I got from TikTok shop. Um, I have to leave them on for 15 minutes, so I'm warming up some food. So the food that I made earlier, I don't know if it was like actually what I made or like from what I ate or I don't know, but like gave me, and I'm so sorry, this is TMI, but it gave me the worst diarrhea, like out of nowhere. It was like as soon as I stopped eating. So I'm a little scared warming this up again. I'm like, I don't know if it was like the cheese from the mac and cheese. I don't know because like I've been eating cheese. Like I know I stopped, I slowed down on the dairy, but like I didn't stop, you know? So I'm like, what the hell? Like it was the most random experience and i'm like what did i do to deserve this like all i wanted to do is eat some mac and cheese like so we're gonna see i hope it don't happen again because that should have had me whew i thought i was gonna get taken out the game so i'm about to i took the illest nap like when i tell you your girl napped I napped, okay? I needed that. So what I'm about to do now is fire up my laptop and start editing this vlog that you're watching. And then, um, what time is it? It is 8.30. I don't think I'm doing anything tonight, but again, things change very quickly for me sometimes. So <laughs> I don't know, maybe I'll see him or I'll go out. I don't know, but it's still early. I'm clean. I'm showered. I'm, you know, after I take these off, I'm going to do my nighttime skincare. Um, I kind of did an everything shower, but obviously I didn't do my hair, but like I shaved, I exfoliated. I just felt like getting really clean. So I'm not naked. I have on this sundress that I turned into a nightgown. <laughs> But anyway, I'm about to start editing and watch some YouTube videos and I will check in. If you guys don't see me tonight, you'll definitely see me tomorrow morning and I will end the vlog. Um, yeah. Say my day's the number, but I keep waking up. No, you see my text, baby, please say something.